going on guys, it's Mesmer here and welcome to how do you open your nat type on the new Call of Duty Advanced Warfare, so yeah, yeah it's in there somewhere. Okay, basically, what you want to do first, cmd, oh, not com, c, at, yes, that one, <laughs> and then you want to type in IP config, no space, and then you want to find your default gateway there, so you can see 10.0.0.138, that's mine, and basically you'll be given uh, that, and it will take you to your web page. Yours won't be exactly the same as mine, but um, basically you want to go to somewhere where you can see your firewall. So mine is in advance, and then it took me to this home page here, and there's firewall, and you can see that number one problem that would be to stop all of your internet altogether from anything connecting would be your firewall is blocking all so to change that you need to be logged in so you can see here I'm logged in as admin you need to press configure then you need to turn it to standard I don't recommend turning it off altogether because that means everything is allowed to pass through including hackers um, the firewall will stop the majority of it but disabling it is just a stupid idea so just leave it on standard so click apply And that's step one done. So now it says your broadband service is working normally, you are connected online, blah, blah, blah. Now another thing to do is check that you have game and application sharing online and see if that's all connected and working. So once it loads, you can see here universal plug and play. So UPNP, that is on, so that's yes. Use extended security, yes. And there's no game or applications assigned to the modem at the moment. So as long as you've got the firewall on step on standard and you've got game and application sharing turned on, to change that you just obviously click configure as well and click the boxes so you can see that they uncheck and check. And then you just click apply and it'll load and you know send the settings to your modem and that'll be all fine. when it loads. Anyway, while we're waiting for that, you also need to open up CMD if you've closed it and ipconfig again, minimize that and type in the same thing as last time, network. Now sometimes uh, in the last one on Black Ops, lots of people came to me asking network infrastructure why can't I see it? There's probably a setting here um, that says like like security something or other saying um, some services are hidden or something like that. Basically you need to be able to turn that off so it's probably in uh, network and properties. You can probably find it here, change advanced, sharing setting, turn on network discovery, turn that on, blah blah blah, all that kind of stuff. Um, change adapter settings, you don't need to do all that unless you're... Um, making other stuff, internet, yeah you don't need to worry about that, windows firewall, you see that's all turned on so yeah you don't need to worry about that. Now the network infrastructure, if it's hidden you need to be able to give yourself permission or you need to open network as the um, as the administrator or something like that so once you get that this is actually your modem, so you can see that's the brand of my modem, Technicolor TG587N version 3. So then you click properties again, settings, you can see here there is no services at the moment because I've just done a fresh restart. Now you need to go add, and let's call this Call of Duty Advanced Warfare. Now the name of the IP is here um, uh, IPv4 I believe yeah so 10.0.0.56 that's my one and click uh, UDP and it's the same as the one before all Call of Duties 3074 what all Call of Duties do, press OK, press OK, and OK, and that's basically it. Now you should have an open that type. 
another thing to do if it's not um, if it's not working Call of Duty Advanced Ports so you just google that you can see here this has all the port numbers so you need to be able to actually go through and basically do the exact same steps but for all of these ones here so you can see here these are all the main ports for Call of Duty Advanced Warfare same one is used for Xbox, so 3074, 27014 to 27050. So add a range of those ports there. So you can see here, we'll go to network again. Network. Properties, settings, add. You can see external, internal. So both add them, same. So you might want to just do Call of Duty Advanced Warfare, like one, the first port or something like that. Add the IPv4 address again, UDP, and add them manually. If that doesn't work, then there's not much else you can do. You probably want to check with your parents or check with your internet provider, um, like if you can get an update on a modem or anything like that or if your internet is actually too slow stuff like that so you can see here you know black ops used 3074 that one black ops 2 3074 as you saw from the last one and then this one is 27014 but i'm fairly sure 3074 would work just the same so okay that's basically the tutorial on how do you open your NAT pipe. Uh, make sure if you if this video has helped you at all, please like and subscribe. And there's going to be a lot more content coming soon. So yeah, stay tuned, guys. I hope this helped you. And thanks.